Okay, calling all of my young and restless fans, what is about to go down in the land of General City next week? Jill try to talk some sense into Billy. Victor hatches a new scheme. Phyllis take a major risk to oust Diane from Genoa City and look like Devon and Abby maybe take their friendship to a different relationship. Welcome back to CBS Soap Dish Recap, where we recap everything CBS Soaps, both the young and the restless, and the bold and the beautiful. This is your spoilers video for the young and the restless for the week of November 7th through November 11th. And without any further ado, let's talk about what's going on next week. Okay, well, first of all, let's talk about Diane Jenkins because everybody is divided at this point over Diane. So while Diane confession is definitely not a good look on somebody who faked her death, Phyllis can't sit back and celebrate. Now, if Jack sees Diane as a victim of Jeremy Stark and Tucker McCall, Kyle and Summer might just come around to that conclusion as well. So... Phyllis will take a risk in her campaign against Diane. Now, the question is, what is she going to do? Will she try to reach out to Jeremy Stark or could she be plotting with Tucker? We have to find out. Now, speaking of Kyle, Kyle is going to draw a line in the sand. Yeah, it looks like he might be unsubscribing from the whole theory that Diane has changed because she broke his trust. Now, Kyle also tells his mother in that preview video as well. Now, Kyle and Summer blast Diane over her deceit, but will that mean that they'll cast her out is the question. After all, Harrison has lost both of his parents last year. Plus, on Friday's cliffhanger, he has a very high fever. And yeah, he really loves his Dee Dee. So, could this little boy be Diane's life preserver? We gotta stick around and find out. Okay, so let's talk about another Abbott. Ashley Abbott and it looks like she's going to be in a vulnerable position. So when Ashley relayed Tucker's version of events about he and Diane being lost souls during their time together in LA, Phyllis wasn't buying it. Now similar to Jack feelings for Diane, Ashley realized that she got a soft spark when it comes to her ex-husband, Tucker. Now, could Tucker take advantage of this vulnerability by offering her Diane on a platter? We gotta find out. So you know when Victor is around, he gets his hands dirty and he plays dirty. So it looks like Victor is gonna be hatching some schemes next week. You know, he always play chess, not checkers. So it comes to no surprise that this week he has a plan of attack against someone who could be his target he is suspicious of tucker mccall's intentions and he's also kind of unnerved by sally's impact on adam and nick will victor try to turn nick against sally in a bid to kind of unify newman enterprises c-suite we gotta stick around and find out well, let's talk more about Sally because she's in the unemployment line right now, but not for long. So the spoilers are teasing us that Sally is going to be plucked out of the unemployment line before she can even get to the front desk. Now, where could she end up? Because originally she was let go from Newman Media as CEO. Well, the teasers are is that Lily could offer Sally Billy's old job. Now, these two ladies could probably do some great things together in business, but will Sally be willing to compete against Victoria? We have to find out, but you know, Sally, try to stop her and see what happens. Well, we all know Elena came back to try to work things out with Nate, and just when it seems like Nate is rebounding from a colossal disaster in his whole business world, he suffer trouble in his whole romantic life now elena as she did return from baltimore and made it abundantly clear that she will not reunite with nate can nate do anything to change her mind or will his whole new gig over at newman media as ceo keep her around well we gotta stay tuned and find out now there's another relationship on the rocks 
Abby and Chance. Now, Abby has had enough. Abby will make an impulsive move when Chan's digging his heels. Now, could this mean that he'll continue to prioritize his job over his wife? You know, Abby hasn't really been, you know, on the same page for a while. But Chance doesn't see how much this is impacting Abby. And it sounds like she's going to run right straight into Devon's arms with a kiss. And then there's another couple that has a little bit of storms on the horizon with their relationship. Not only Chance and Abby, but Billy and Lily. So it looks like they got a rough road ahead because Lily is beginning to lose faith in Billy. Now, she is sympathetic to Chelsea's mental health issues. She don't understand, however, how her boyfriend's crusade that he has to protect his exes. Now, the spoilers are teasing us that Billy has a narrow tunnel vision mind when it comes to putting his relationship with Lily in jeopardy this week by attending to Chelsea. So we got to stay tuned for this. And speaking of Lily, Lily calls his mom, Jill, in as reinforcement. So in a desperate move, She's going to disclose Billy's latest actions to Jill. Now, even though she'll be proud of his heroic behavior, you know, the night that Chelsea nearly took her life, there's a little bit of other teasers that are telling us that Jill will give her son a very harsh reality check. And, you know, she always say, you don't have another woman like Lily. Why don't screw this up, Billy? Well, she's right, but will it make any headway or any difference? We got to find out next week. Okay, so there you have it, your Young and the Restless spoilers for the week of November 7th through November 11th, 2022. Stay tuned for the spoilers for the bold and the beautiful also for next week. And until the next video, like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you soon. Bye.